Get mind-bending, shape-shifting transitions in Cineflare Shapeshifter. Cineflare Shapeshifter was created exclusively for Final Cut Pro. You can find them in the Titles browser under Cineflare Shapeshifter. The presets are broken up into categories that describe the motion in the transitions. Wipe, Rotate, Zoom, and Return. The thumbnails give you a clue on the direction of the motions. Each effect includes a begin and end element that go together. Why titles effects instead of transition effects? When you overlay these title effects around a cut, you don't have to worry about overlap in your clips like with a transition effect. Plus, the titles act as adjustment layers so you can transition anything placed below them, like graphics and titles. Let's take a look at how these work. I'll drop the Rotate 9 Begin and End around a cut on my timeline. In its default state, there's a shape overlay that the clips rotate through, in this case, something called Circle Triangle. In the Shape dropdown, we have a ton of different included shapes to choose from. Additionally, the list includes custom image and custom text, which you can customize below. I'll go with rings for my clip. In the animation section, I can control the amount of travel of the spin movement and add a scale effect. The rotate checkbox turns off and on the rotation effect on the shapes if you'd like. Below this, in the effects section, adjust the rotational blur or prism effect if you'd like. I'll quickly tweak the end transition like the begin, but there's nothing that says they have to be exactly the same. And that's as easy as it gets to add some amazing motion and shape effects to your footage. Cineflare Shapeshifter will really move your cuts along and will come in handy on all sorts of different projects. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com. Subscribe to this channel for more great videos every week.